Okay. What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Crystal Walk through the 2022-2023 edition. I don't know. We will find out. Might be doing two episodes a day. If we are, then it's my it's 2022. I don't know. I'm, I'm just going off on a tangent. Anywho, in our last episode, yes, we won our 11th badge. Yes, we are taking badges, taking names and all that stuff with different Pokemon, you know, from Generation 2 and all that, or Generation 1, I should say. And now, we're going to be going into the cycling road, going down to Fuchsia City, because yes, we are the gym, well, the gym badges collectors and all that stuff. And, oh, uh, crap baskets, I probably should have a Pokemon for that. I'll be right back with you guys. Okay, so here we are, we're back. Okay, so, getting Paris right here, we're going to be cutting this whole thing, and there might be a little something, something right around here somewhere. Now, if you guys remember, in the original versions, you have to go through big old room like this and this is where you will be finding yourself the HMO2 person but right now we're gonna be looking at this guy he's like if you cruise down Cyclone Road you will end up in Fuchsia City so nothing I completely wasted my time with that my bad okay so let's see what is there to do right here yes yeah, so we're gonna be moving on forward and we're gonna be you know getting the original team back so we can speed battle everybody right here so I'll be right back with you guys Alrighty, so here we are back again, and now it is time for us to go down to Cycling Road and look at that. Okay, so Cycling Road, Route 16, BAM, Route 17. If you guys remember, there was a buttload of Pokemon trainers around here, and, uh, well, like I said before, we're gonna be battling everybody, speed, you know, and the speed button and all that stuff, and it looks like to me there's not a lot of Pokemon trainers here. Where the heck are you guys? Oh, there you are, okay made me feel lonely and all that stuff okay so here we go let's battle bring it all right we're taking on biker Joel, and he's coming out with his magmar big booty head magmar coming out with Hera this should be fun so we're gonna be speed training throughout this whole thing right here look at that see easy stuff okay and Super Terra, Super Terra, of course, is grabbing uh, or getting some experience points right there. So we're going to be switching it out right here to Togepi. And let's go ahead and do this whole thing right here. Shadow Ball. There we go. We have defeated Joel. Look at that. Okay. That's pretty much what we're going to be doing for the next few routes right here, guys. You know, we have a boatload of Pokemon trainers that we definitely don't want to battle. But we have to because, you know, it's a must. Getting experience points and then what's ahead... And if you guys feel like you're struggling around here, yes, it's uh, it's pretty much an uphill battle right here. So here we go, we're taking on another guy. Hey, want to have a speed battle? Yes! Let's go ahead and have a speed battle. Boom. Let's go with uh, Earthquake Attack, that's right. It still works in this generation, until Generation 3. And look at that, Serpentero's finally at level 50! And let's go with an Earthquake, and just like that, we have defeated uh, Glenn in a speed battle. Look at that, you see? Okay, so, let us move on right here. There is a little bit of a secret entrance right there. Not really, but there's a Pokemon trainer waiting for us. Doesn't want to... Well, he's seen what happened, so he doesn't want to battle us. So, speed battle it away. All right, Riley. Time to get this Earthquake attack, and bam. There you go. All righty. So, we get some more points. Yes, what a kick. All right, so let's go ahead and switch up our Pokemon right here. Now that Serpentir is at level 51, or 50, let's go ahead and give Chico a bit of love. Everybody's evened out. Bring it. We're going to be going downhill. Look at that. I'm not even using controller right now. All right, move ahead. Let's see. Who is next? Like Goldberg said, who's next? Not a lot. Not a lot. Okay, so let's see. There really isn't anybody. Okay, so I was expect. I was expecting a lot of battles, but never mind, we got one more. All right, bring it. We're fearless highway stars. Okay, so, bring it. All righty, so let's go right ahead and take on Charles, and uh, let's go ahead and speed this way. Body slam. All right, we're going to be bad at body slamming away right here. And like I was saying, yes. Let's go right ahead and continue on right here. Bam. Smug attack and nothing else. And here we are. Level 52 still. That's right. Crash and burn. What's up? Alrighty. So let's go right ahead and get the heck out of here. Alrighty. So that was Cycling Road. And 
here we are into route whatever we are right here. Let's see, Route 18, going into Fuchsia City. And, well, we got some more trainers right here. Let's go right ahead and uh, battle everybody that we see. If you're looking for Pokemon, you have a, you have to look at tall grasses. Alrighty. Alright, bring it. Let's go. Alrighty, Boris wants to come out, wants to battle us, and, well, look at this, Doduo. Doduo is looking uh, pretty mean right there, but Chico is about to speed away here. Look at that. Alrighty. Okay, so Serpentera not doing anything else, and let's go right ahead and switch out our Pokemon right here. Let's go ahead and use Fluff Vault. Alrighty. Fluff Vault, Thunder Punch, and continuing on. There we go. Coming out with the Dodrio. Dodrio is going to get a Thunder Punch. And just like that, bam, level 53, Serpentera mooching off of us, and just like that, we have defeated another Pokemon trainer. Look at that. Yeah, speed training through this whole thing. Let's go. Alrighty. Okay, so, another bird trainer coming out. Bird, bird Keeper Bob, a Sideshow Bob, coming out with a Noctowl right here. And, well, let's go ahead and speed through it. Look at that. Body slam for the win. Le oh, almost grew to level 53. Come on. Alrighty. That is pretty much it. Okay. So, here we are, guys. Fuchsia City. And, uh, well, there's quite a few things about Fuchsia City. Yeah. Fuchsia City is a bit of a disappointment right here because, well, let's see, there's a notice. Safari Zone, of, uh, Safari Zone office is closed until further notice. That's right, there's no Safari Zone. Apparently they were going to make it, and, well, they were going to make it when Generation 2 was going to come out, and, well, there's nobody here. Holy crud. Yeah, they were going to, they were going to make it, but then, you know, everything got scrapped and all that crud, so it is what it is. And, well, we're going to be going straight to the Warden's house, and let's go ahead and see what, what it's all about right here. My grandpa is the Safari Zone Warden. At least he was. He decided to go on vacation and took off overseas all by himself. He quit running the Safari Zone just like that. Really? Okay. So, yeah. Like I said, guys, it was a bit disappointing just because there was no Safari Zone. There was quite a, like, there was a lot of things taken out in Generation 2 that, you know, just, like, you're, you're like, really, like that? It's going to be taken out like that? Seriously? Oh my god, okay. So, going on to the next thing right here. Just checking out the houses and all that stuff. We're going to be walking straight to, let's see. Let's go straight right here. There's a Pokemon gym, the Fuchsia City gym. The gym leader name is Janine. If you guys remember, our buddy Koga is now a an Elite Four member. And if you go here, talk to this lady. She's like, my grandpa is at Bill, or my brother Bill's uh, on Cerulean Cape. Hmm. So that's quite a few places. And I saw these weird slow Pokemon on Cycling Road. Hmm. What kind of slow Pokemon are we talking here? I want to know. Okay, so another thing you guys should already know. If you go down here, you will be able to see this sign. And please be careful if you are swimming to Seafoam Islands. Fuchsia City Police. Okay, so there is something going on right here. If you talk to this gentleman, he's going to be like, Cinnabar's volcano erupted. It hurled boulders that cut off Route 19 indefinitely. I wonder if the people in Cinnabar are safe. And, well, let's go right ahead and take a look at this right here. Yeah, nobody's safe. Look at that. Everything has been blocked off. And if you talk to this guy, he's like, Sorry, this road is closed for construction. If you want to get to Cinnabar, you'd better go to south from Palatown. And who knows how long it would take to move these boulders. It's going to take a while, guys. Eventually, eventually it's going to it's gonna end right there. So, first thing is first, guys. We're going to be going into the next Pokemon gym. I will be right back. I am going to go and... Yeah, I am going to go and grab ourselves the specific Pokemon for this gym battle right here. So, I'll be right back with you guys. See you guys. Oh. Alrighty guys, so here we are, we're ready to go. We picked our team, we're only gonna go with five Pokemon right here. We have de decided to go with Serpentera, Ultra Psycho, Terramon, Aaliyah, and Torpedo. So, let's do this. Bring it. Oh man, I am excited right here, and let's go ahead and talk to the guy who's ever believed in us. Yo, champ in the making! 
Whoops. Take a look around. Uh, the trainers all look like Janine. Which one of them is the real Janine? I normally... Yeah, I normally pick the, like... I normally pick the wrong one, but this must be the wrong Janine. Look at that. Fooled you! <laughs> Bring it. Okay. Here it is, taking on last Linda, and she is going to be coming out with her Bulbasaur right here. And Bulbasaur, yes, both grass and and steel, or not grass and, and poison type. Let's go right ahead and go with an earthquake. See if that actually works right there. And Bulbasaur. Defeated. Look at that. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. There we go. And, well, yeah, we're getting some some experience points right here. And what's next? Linda is going to be coming out with an Ivysaur. Who did I choose? Yes, you know what? Let's go straight for Torpedo right here. And, well, Torpedo. It does have an Ice Type move. I could teach it to something else. So let's go straight for an Icy Wind right here. And there we go. Icy Wind. Defeats Ivysaur. Still don't understand why, yeah, these guys right here don't, uh, well, don't evolve their Pokemon. I have, like, three brutal Pokemon, but then again, we're talking about cat games and stuff. So, let's go right ahead. Go right here. Venusaur versus Torpedo. Take this Icy Wind. That's right. Alrighty, alrighty. And Venusaur... Oh my god, nearly defeated, and its speed has fallen, so here comes a Sweet Sand. Not gonna do much, but here comes the Icy Wind. For the win! And just like that... There goes Venusaur. Alrighty, okay. And... Well, Serpentera grows level 51, that is great, fantastic. And Linda has been defeated. Oh, I lost! You're not weak! No, I am not. Okay, time to locate Janine, because she's doing the same thing her daddy did once when we were battling, so before she turns around, let's go ahead and switch it out to uh, Ultra Saga right here. You know, let's go, bring it. I'm Janine. How did you know I was real? Let's battle. That's not Janine at all. Okay, bring it. So here we go, Cindy wants to battle. What's going on right here? She's coming out with a Nido Queen, so this place is a little bit more diverse. That's pretty fun. But I'm afraid I'm gonna have to use my Ultra Psycho Psychic Attack right here. Look at that. Psychic Attack. For the win! There we go. Nido Queen defeated. Look at that. Okay, alrighty. And, well, Cindy, you know, defeated and all that stuff. Yeah, she, she, she thought so. <laughs> okay, so, let's see, let's give everybody a little bit of a turn right here. Let's go switch it up to Terramon. It has been a while since I've used Terramon. I think she will like him. Or he. <laughs> you betcha, I'm Janine. Okay, so everybody is Janine. Is this kind of like a, you know, I'm the Blue Ranger. I'm the Red Ranger. You know, that kind of stuff. And, oh my god, he's coming out with a Nido King. Alrighty. Let's go. Earthquake attack. And, well, Nido King is faster than us, so yeah, that's not going to be so effective. But here comes Earthquake attack. For the win. And just like that, Nido King has been defeated. Alrighty, okay, alrighty. Oh, that was easy. Shoot. <laughs> yeah, your disguise was right on, but yeah. Okay, so I'm afraid that this one is Janine, but let's see. Hmm. You know what? Let's go with this one. Nope. Yep, that's right. Okay, so I got everybody. I got everybody. I normally leave out one person. Kind of annoying. Yeah. But I was kind of right about the whole, like, that not being Janine. So here she comes out with a gloom. This might be a little bit of a challenge for Terramon, despite its level capabilities and all that stuff. So let's go with an Earthquake attack right here. And... There we go. Earthquake attack. For the win! And Serpentera gets some more points just for not doing anything. And, well, she's, or she's gonna be coming out with a, a Gloom. So, let's go with Ultra Psycho right here. 
and gloom is looking uh, pretty gloomy right there. Alrighty, Ultra Psycho, how's it going? Psychic deck. There we go. Now, when am I gonna use my Pikachu? I don't know. We'll find out very, very soon. Alrighty. Alrighty, so there it is. Psychic attack for the win. Who's next? I do not know. And Alice is gonna come out with an Arbok, so let's just continue it on right here. Ultra Psycho just defeating all these Pokemon. Look at that. Big old Cobra with a big old diagram on its on his chest. Well, time to eat this. There you go. And Arbok has been defeated. Alrighty. Okay. Okay, look at that. Okay, so Alice has been defeated. I had you fooled. Not really. I kind of have a diagram seeing you guys and all that stuff. Okay, so let's go right ahead and start off with Serpentera. I want Serpentera to get this thing right here. Alrighty, so bring it on ahead. The corner Pokemon trainer. Foo, 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 foo. I'm sorry to disappoint you. I'm only joking. I'm the real deal. Janine of Fuchsia City Gym. That's me. I love this song. Okay, so here it is, guys. What's up? We're taking on Gym Leader Janine. The, well, the air of this whole place. And crap, I should have used Pikachu. God dang it. Okay. Alrighty. Maximum effort. Let's go switch it out with uh, Pikachu right here. Let's go, Aaliyah. Time to do your thing. What's up? Yes, I do have a Pikachu, and here comes a Confuse Ray. You think... You think that's gonna stop me? This is funny. Confuse Ray. Okay, so let's go right ahead and use... Let's see, a full restore right here. There we go. Came to its senses. What's up? Coming out with a Screech attack right here. Now, the, of course, the Fuchsia City Gym is more strategic than anyone else. But guess what? Crap baskets. Really? You got two confusion attacks? This is ridiculous. Okay. Let's go again. Confuse. Come on, Leah. Come on. God dang it. Okay, so just like it. What? Are you serious? Oh my god. Oh my god. We took a hit. Alrighty. So, time for some revenge. Time for some revenge right here. Revenge. Best served as. I don't know. Wait, do I have a repel or do I have a revive? Where are the revives? Ah, oh, baskets. Okay. Yeah, I completely forgot about that. Now it's gonna be re well, it's gonna be a uh, it's gonna be revenge. So here comes a supersonic. Time to eat this rollout. Oh yes, Aaliyah is going to have its uh is she's going to have his her revenge right here. And here comes a supersonic. And oh god. Oh my god, oh my god. Okay, come on, Terramon. Do it. There you go. Time to eat that. There we go. Alrighty, okay. So there goes... There goes Crobat. Sir Patera gets some points. And here comes an Ariados. And, well, we're going to continue on right here with Terramon. And hopefully this confusion just wears off. And crap baskets. There we go. Another rollout. Oh, yes, you can't stop this Pokemon. The spirit of freaking Whitney is with us right now in her mill tank. So that's two. It's become even more powerful. You cannot stop them. And, well, we're going to continue on right here. Let's go. Bring it, Venomoth. And here comes a dire hit. Come on, come on, come on. And here we go again with another rollout. Okay, so I guess this battle is a little bit easier than I thought. Except for Pikachu. There you go. There it is. Work it. That's right. Are we going to test our luck again? Probably. And, well, let's go. Let's go. No more. And there it is, guys. <laughs> we are no longer confused. Time to eat this wheezing. Time to eat it. There we go. That's right. How does it feel to fail? Terramon is dominating. Kind of feel like a waste. And, well, it comes a, here she's coming out with another wheezing, so let's finish this guy off with one more rollout, right? Hopefully. Damn it! So it only works for five turns, I guess. So here comes the Earthquake attack. Here it is. There it is. Look at that. Okay, alrighty. Just like that. Terramon dominates everybody. 
For revenge of, uh, well, for, for Leah, and, uh, you know, my, my niece is gonna be mad at me for this one. You're a tough one. You definitely won! Here's a soul badge. Take it! Yes. That's right. Throwing out the peace sign, guys. I am throwing out the peace sign. Gym battle number 12. You're so tough, I have to give you a special gift. It's toxic, a powerful poison that steadily saps uh, the victim's HP. And there it is, guys. We got ourselves the TM-06, a very, very useful TM. I'm going to really apply myself to improve my skills. I want to become better than both you and my father. Mm, okay, alrighty. Let's see myself. Okay, she's going to say the same thing. Okay, so, yeah, there we go, guys. We have won 12 badge in all. That is halfway right there. So, the next place we're going to be going to is kind of like a... I want to say it's a bit of a side quest. Well, it is a bit of a side quest, and that is that we're going to be going north, going to Lavender Town, doing all its things, and yeah, we're going to be going to the Rock Tunnel and all that stuff, and finally leading up to Cerulean City. So we're going to be going back with our regular team, and uh, yeah, during this whole little adventure that we're going to be going on, we're going to be doing a little bit of speed training too, speed button and all, because you guys already know how much I hate these other routes, routes 16, 14, 15, whatever, double digits. It is what it is. So thank you guys again for watching. Thank you guys for supporting and all that stuff. If you guys want to make a small donation to this channel, our button's right there below. I will be back for another episode of our Pokemon Crystal Walkthrough. See you guys.